we are exploring. Today I am going to show you just one car, and that is King of Rock and Roll Elvis Presley's 1967 Ford Fairlane 500 Ranchero here at the Museum of Automobiles near Morrilton, Arkansas. They have a collection of over 60 cars, I would estimate, and there are some cool ones here, but today I'm just gonna show you this one car. And there we're approaching the Ford Ranchero, once owned by King of Rock and Roll, Elvis Presley. Early in 1967, Elvis was driving around one time in the area around Horn Lake, Mississippi, and he saw a ranch that was for sale, and he immediately wrote out a check for a down payment to the owner of the ranch, and he wanted to purchase it. And just a few days later, Elvis Presley was the proud owner of a new ranch he called the Circle G Ranch. Or the logo shows the Circle G with a pair of wings attached, as you're going to see in a moment. So it is unclear. Some call it the Flying Circle G Ranch, and others call it the Circle G Ranch. This is an interesting car that he bought actually for his fiancée Priscilla Bullio, whom he married in May 1967. He bought this car though in, I believe, February 1967. This is an interesting concept car. Oh, look here. They have a photo of Elvis's dad, Vernon Presley, at the steering wheel of the Circle G Ranch Ford Fairlane Ranchero. That is pretty neat. Yes, the concept of the car. In the front it's more like a sedan. Oh, here it has the Ranchero logo on the side underneath the gas tank. It's a mixture of a sedan in the front and a pickup truck in the back. I'm not sure how useful this would be for practical matters if you're on a ranch or on a farm because there's not that much clearance between the bottom of the car and the ground to do the really hard work and I'm not sure if this Ford would sustain the what whatever is necessary to be a workhorse truck. So Although I find them really cool, that combination, you don't see it very often with that pickup style bed in the, in the back. Circle G Ranch. When I lived in Memphis a few years ago, I was a writer for the German Elvis fan magazine Graceland. And in one of my articles, I wrote about the history of Elvis's Circle G Ranch. And part of this was, of course, this car here. Look, they have the souvenir license plate on the car that you can buy at Graceland. So I wrote this article and the photo of Elvis's dad in the car popped up. And I was always wondering where this car might be. I couldn't find it out. One day, by sheer accident, I visited the Museum of Automobiles here in Morrilton, Arkansas, pretty close to Patty Jean State Park, and I was excited to see the Ford Ranchero from the Circle G Ranch here, not knowing it was here at the museum. After Elvis had bought the ranch, he got himself a herd of cattle and played cowboy for a while, but his manager and his dad pressured him into making money again, recording records. So after a year, Elvis Presley sold the ranch and traded this ranchero in at a Cadillac dealership for a new Cadillac, about a year after he had bought it. 
I hope you learned something new today. And I hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I enjoyed making it.